what's up guys this is Phoebe's here make sure you guys hit that like button and hit that subscribe button and also enter my code use life 136 over at sponsorgamers.com so that way you guys can get a discount and get that g fill and all your gaming apparel alrighty guys so long story short if you couldn't tell Today's video is definitely going to be about Madden 18, and, well, got some new uh, news, and this is actually from an article from Forbes.com, which is weird, weird. Uh, they were talking about, I guess, during the EA Play 2017, uh, that was at the E3 Expo, uh, things that they were basically saying, well, of course you guys already know. You pre order the GOAT edition at uh, GameStop or on Xbox or on PlayStation. You will get the game, uh, I think, a couple of days, or I think on the 22nd is what they were saying. Uh, other than that, it will be out August 25th for everybody. Um, and of course, if you're EA Access, you get the game 10 hours before 21 on. Uh, we get a preview of the game on August 17th. So, remember that all you EA Access guys. Uh, early access will be available August 17th at the day before my birthday. Look at that. Um, two, well, we already know that the game's on Frostbite. So, with it being on Frostbite, that basically makes it be able to deliver the same exact graphic capability that. Powerful one possibly was able to throw at us, and it's a bit worth hoping that the visuals look a lot more better, a lot more detail on the stadiums, players, especially with the NFL getting a, uh, switching out how the jerseys look a little bit this year. But we'll have to see. Um, that also relates to NHL 18. Hopefully, they switch over to Frostbite, but we doubt it. Um, with that, also. I can't show you guys any gameplay from EA Play because they literally have been taking down people's channel left and right. And when I mean left and right, I mean they're telling people if you show leak footage of anything, you're not going to like life. Uh, like I said, uh, with that, the, the leak footage, you can pretty much type in leak footage Madden 18 to find out. The game looks a lot more cleaner, a lot more crisper. Uh, you can definitely see where how the field looks uh, uh, so far because the only footage we got was that uh, uh, Carolina and the Redskins that was leaked. And he'll get it up a little great. I'm not gonna lie, field looked great. Uh, players, you know, look great. I'm sure they're gonna probably clean it up even more after that because once they clean it up, it's gonna be looking just beautiful and stellar. I can't wait for that. Um, and of course, like I said, Madden 18 will be in full 4K. Because uh, I guess uh, uh, EA Play, most of the game for being put on the Xbox One X is what it was reported at EA Play. So we'll get a full 4K Madden, which is great. I really, I'm not sure it's fine. So far what we know about the story mode, uh, it looks like a uh, origin story. Uh, it's about three high school. And it's supposed to bring in uh, high school and college a little bit to the adventure. And then I guess we never reach uh, the guy that you play as played. I guess he never reached the NFL, but uh, the whole game is more story driven than with the journey was, which is with Alex Hunter on pizza. So we'll see how that plays out. I'm not really too excited for that besides just like FIFA you will be getting butt cards Madden Ultimate Team points and cards and stuff playing points of story um we finally are getting target passing you know uh, basically that means you can lead your receivers you can put the ball wherever you need to down and away uh, over up and over the shoulder wherever you need to try to get away from the defender I'm trying to get more book that is uh, more uh, 
usage back to the players. You know, instead of all these forced computer animations that were just god annoying. <laughs> so, they like said, we'll see how that goes, and hopefully everything goes well with that. Um, and he's going to be mad at about the I guess, uh, and then the same thing that the sports article talks about, uh, they improved the coverage. I guess, uh, Rex, uh, the producer Rex Dickerson, I guess, talked about the improved zone coverage, uh, there would be better zone discipline defend, uh, with defenders who are designed to the flat stain clip, while those that are tasked with covering mid range throws also stay in true to their areas. So, no more people just kind of sitting there not doing anything. Anything. Uh, pressing the tight end is another thing that they're going to be able to do. Uh, so you go over to cover tight ends, which like your best guy, like uh, Rob, Cal Rob Gakowski, Travis Kelsey, you know, players like that. So we'll see how that goes. And then uh, another thing, there's going to be different game styles. So there's going to be, of course, simulation. There's going to be arcade, the quick get in and get out. And then, apparently, there's going to be a uh, competition style. Now, people are saying that it's supposed to be based off of what the competition style is basically based on what EA uses as their competition itself. So, we shall see. I doubt it. I'll be shocked if it is. Um, and then, of course, off ball injuries uh, are coming into the game. That means players are getting injured away from the ball, not just if your player happens to get injured in whoever's carrying the ball or making the tackle, so you'll see the other thing. Uh, injury presentation still won't be coming back. They're not completely diagnosed for days, but we don't know the timetable. But like I said, we'll see how the how the preview is, how the presentation. Uh, but squads equals co-op play, co play now. So they're bringing back co-op play with Madden Ultimate Teams, three on three gameplay, which is thank God I, I enjoy that a lot. Um, but uh, so they finally put uh, so you'll see sideline interactions, uh, more updated touchdown celebration. So there's that getting the, into the details of that, and then a couple of presentation elements you're going to notice right away are the pre-game sequences. I guess they're being called upcuts. <laughs> whatever that means. Uh, they're fast paced, establishing shorts of both environments and players coming out ahead of the game. So, I mean, basically, if you remember Madden Ball, where they had the intros, that's what we're getting back in the game. So, the commentary, of course, will be Brandon Golden and uh, Charles Davis. Madison was the best video game in history, in my opinion. I doubt it. I still think the best commentary in any sports game. <laughs> We'll go to, if not MLB 2K series, or probably the NBA 2K series. So we'll see. Uh, what else? The, uh, there's gonna be other uh, legends and other modes. So we said about ultimate team. You'll be able to add them to other game modes. Apparently. You can edit your uh, draft class. It's going to be improved AI and then, of course, uh, more esports related things. So, pretty much, the producer opened up a lot, gave us a lot of answers. We still don't have firm footage, well, firm gameplay that they're allowing us to show. As you can see, what you're seeing right now is Madden 17. Um, so, we'll, we'll see what they give us and hopefully it will be something good. Other than that, until next time guys, see you guys next time. I, I will be releasing videos every Wednesday now, so I do have a schedule, thank God. Uh, every Wednesday will, I'll be releasing a video, uh, and then of course my Twitch streams are pretty much I'll be posting on Twitter what days I'm off my, my job to be able to stream for you guys. Other than that, follow me on Twitter, 
uh, Scott underscore Markel. Other than that, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.